Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Fallout Nevada. We're still in Area 51, still trying to do things, um, kill aliens. And there's three of them here, beyond this little thing. And we have two options, either slog it out, or use a Psycho and slog it out. Now, slo um, Psycho will decrease our damage taken by quite a lot. Uh, should allow us to maybe kill two of them before retreating. We're actually running out of ammunition for the hunting rifle. Huh. <clears throat> well, we can always return. Um, we can always return and get rid of stuff and get more. Are these guys getting their health up? No. Oh, freaking hell. I can't have misses right now. Come on. And of course, he's not getting up. Brilliant. Oh, that's so annoying. I need criticals. You gotta be shitting me. Oh, come on. <sighs> Alright, I'm gonna try one more. And what? No damage. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. This is insane. <clears throat> Alright, come on. Let me, let me just reload. Come on. Yeah, yeah. Holy moly, missed twice in a row with very high chances to hit and then did no damage. You've got to be kidding me. Twenty-five. Ow. Ow. <clears throat> Alright, which one is the lowest on, on their health? This one. Come on. At least we can go past them here. He just needs one more shot, I think. A nice critical, and he'll be dead. He oh no, he did hit us. Ow! 27. Oh my god. These are just freaking horrible. I'll have to use a Psycho, it seems. I hate the fact how you go through here, and it puts you all the way down here. Instead of where, you know, you actually start. I'm gonna just use my action points to go over here. Uh, take the damage. Don't knock me down. Yeah, of course you're gonna knock me down with the last one, but at least we got up immediately. So we didn't lose the uh, action points. Come on. 34. Should I stay here more? No, that already goes back. Okay. <clears throat> Until healed. Man, these these three particular ones are annoying. Well, one, because you have to... Uh, uh, combat all of them at once. And two, because it puts you so far out. Eh. Okay. Right, back we go. And of course, they go first. Okay, come on. You've got to be kidding me. Still didn't kill it. And now it's going to do no damage or it's going to do like one damage. Oh, really? I killed him? Four damage. <laughs> oh. Oh, jeez. 21. Feel the pain. And now he's going to knock me down. No. Get out of here, stalker. just insane these things <clears throat> all right all righty let's get back our health and uh, we'll see if we can exit the base via that ventilation um quite interesting maybe we definitely have to go back to window war to offload stuff sell stuff if we can uh, that assault rifle, for example, which is kind of useless on these guys, and I usually don't like burst weapons that much anyway. Especially with a sniper character. Okay, so all the way over there. This one has 113. Let him come to us. And then we'll run to the exit. 
Yeah. Oh, of course. And of course you stay down. Brilliant. All right, let's see. Really? I hit him? 23. That's not enough. I need more. Oh. These are nasty. They're just called aliens, but I'm sure these guys are different. I mean, obviously that one has 160 hit points, but they must have... Oh, freaking hell. They must have better attacks. Um, higher chances to hit. Maybe a uh, higher critical chance. It, it just feels like it. <laughs> We're spending weeks here in Area 51. Okay, save again. And when we run out of ammunition for the hunting rifle, it's going to be a little bit of a problem. Well, actually, it's not going to be because we're just going to go back to... Uh, uh, three hit points. Win the war. I wonder, if I went through here and used the ladder, they wouldn't really be able to follow me, will they? Let's see. That'd be quite interesting. Blip, blip. I could maybe stay here and have only one of them attack me, but of course he's gonna knock me down and yada yada. Uh, they will attack me now because we don't have enough time units to... Oh, no, we do. Okay, let's see what happens. Ha ha! You little shits. Unfortunately, we have to shoot him from afar. Actually, we can't hit him from here at all. Well, that sucks. Yeah, these are working. Well, that one is. Oh, hello. Can I hit you from here? Oh, of course not. I can hit that one. But shooting him normally is not gonna work. Exactly. <clears throat> I need criticals. Hmm. Let's see. Uh, is there anything else there? Well, we can go out of here. Okay. It's this place. Um... I'm gonna go back to win the war and get rid of some of this stuff and get more ammunition. <laughs> so, win the war, <clears throat> sell things, maybe buy some stim packs, which we're never using. I tend to keep, um, um, what does he say? Pay attention and you might even survive or something like that. Barter. This thing is interesting though. He's only got 140 bucks, really? After all this time? That sucks. I could buy this, I suppose. Get rid of this. Um... Get rid of, uh, no, the big book of science is still useful. Where's the first, uh, field medic first aid kit? Get rid of that, but that's going to be too expensive, probably. Well, sort of. Oh, he's, okay. Well, that's all right. You can have that. Excellent. See what you have. Do you sell drugs? Well, that's quite expensive. Got 548. All right. Um, I really don't need the Mentats because we're at level 10 intelligence, but I suppose I'm going to keep them just in case we need them for some sort of ingredient or something later on. 250. Might get rid of the shotgun because we don't have enough um, strength anyway. Oh. Yeah. 
Lovely. Okay, let's go check this guy out as well. Let's trade! Ah, excellent. This is what I need. He's got 577. And lots of different stuff, but none of this stuff is really going to help me against the, uh, the aliens. This doesn't sell for anything. This does. Uh, but it's such a rare thing, that stealth boy. I'm going to keep it for now. I'm also going to keep the 5mm JHP. I think it's mostly just used for miniguns and such, but eh, just in case. I'm going to get rid of these. Um, all of them. Okay. Uh, three, six, eight. And I'm going to have to get rid of maybe this. Because he doesn't have enough. Oops. Yeah. Lovely. And I think I'm going to keep the rest of the stuff in the uh, personal locker. A personal safe, as they call it. All right, so stealth boat goes in here. The, this goes in here. Uh, the big book of science I'm going to use. I'm going to get rid of this stuff for now. Make medicines in the field. I'll have to try that. I'm going to keep this, even though it doesn't actually weigh anything. Um, I don't know if I should keep the metal detector on me right now. I will for now. There's the ammunition. Here's the plasma grenades and the pulse grenades. The energy cells, which are ammunition for something this way, is quite a lot. I don't need the Geiger counter right now. I'll keep the shovel. Um, oh yeah, and this thing, mysterious device, which I think weighs stuff, if I'm not mistaken. Crowbar. Where is that? Uh, oh, there's the filter. Okay. 107. Not too bad, I suppose. Um, was there not a crafting station here? Um, I guess not. That's a shame. Hmm. I was hoping to see what we could do with those uh, blueprints, if anything at all. But I guess not. Alright. Well. Uh, how much ammunition do we have now? What is it? Where did it go? There. 65 plus uh, whatever is in the hunting rifle. 12, I think. Eh, that should be okay. I think. Area 51! Back to that lovely place. Airplane landing area, barracks. Well, let's go to the landing area and then go through here. To the ventilation area. What? How did we... Oh, it just puts you over here. Okay, I understand. So, there was another safe here. Uh, I was... Uh, I thought it was down here. Yeah, it's over there. Let me in! There's another gas canister there! It's an emergency! We need it now! I mean, um, <clears throat> I don't care about these doors opening at all. I don't want them to open. That would be horrible. It would make my day so much worse. Oh, no. I hope they don't open. Yeah. All right, let's see. So, we've got more numbers now. Back to this one. 153. So, 153... Uh, six for eight. So six and back and four and more and eight. God, this is annoying. And nine or eight, seven. So five, four, three, nine or eight, seven. Finish. Yes, code is correct. Okay, let me make that one there. Put a note down that I've uh, used it. There's another canister. All right, let's get out of here. Is there another exit on this map? No. Come on. 
Of course, those doors close now. Let me out. Let me out. Thank you. Okay. Let's go into the hangar. These turrets should be operational, I think. Which is kind of late. That goo is glowing quite nicely. I like that. Uh, what did we leave over here? I think... No, not plastic explosive. Something else. I'll take that for now. Just so we clean things up. Oh yeah, I also forgot to uh, get rid of my... Infection. Oh well. Oh yeah, these guys are back. Oh, they're being hit. By what? Here? Unless, of course, that they're being hit on the lower level already. Holy moly, they must be. Uh, I don't think there's anything else to this place here. What is that? A flamer. Well, flamer would be nice, but... Uh, there's kind of a lot of aliens around. Of course he's going this way. Can we get past him? Oh, there's another alien there. Never mind. Oh man. They just keep respawning here, it seems. We also need to get to that computer over there. Who's gonna see us? Can we get in here? Before they see us? Because it's gonna aggro, aggro the rest of them. <laughs> close the doors. How do we close the door? <laughs> Can hell. Of course I need to use a science skill. The system is ready to work. Enter the following command. Look at a list of notes. Uh, memos of the last available month have been sorted by topic. Uh, there are mostly usual production and delivery reports, but you see a few interesting notes. Reports on malfunctions in the turret control program. About an error in, in the turret's control program. This is a, notifi a notification from the security officer stating that there was some kind of bug in the turret control uh, program. The program glitched regularly, which in turn... Oh, they're still moving. Uh, led to frequent restarts. Each restart would disable the turrets. Okay, back, back, back. Log out. I need to close the damn door. Oh, freaking... Of course he's coming here. They actually zoom in on you, don't they? Oh, this sucks. It... If the rest are gonna come now, we're... yeah. Yeah, they are. Brilliant. Mind you, even if I did close the doors, they would still come here. Well, we're, uh, we're gonna have to reload. How do you do this then? I mean, maybe by killing most, but no, apart from two, I guess? I don't know. Jeez. Ah, yeah. Ha, ha, ha. Good. Good joke. I like joke. Yeah, of course he's gonna miss now that I would have killed him with 90%. Oh, man. And I can't even escape now, by the way, because I'm stuck in here. Hey. Okay. That's freaking annoying. Uh, where's my drugs? Well, there's a psycho. Whoop! We're not addicted. But what? Only twenty damage resistance? I thought it gave you more. Take another one. And now we're an addict. And it didn't seem to do much. Brilliant. So I can just reload. I thought they stacked. Man, this is annoying. Why the hell do these guys just respawn over here? I can understand them respawning down there where there's eggs and everything, but... I don't see any actual unopened eggs here. It's so annoying that they just follow you there. 
There we go. That one's already coming, I think. Close it. Can I lock it? No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Science skill, I know. It, it should freeze all the aliens while we're doing this. Uh, glitched regulator, which in turn led to frequent restarts. Each restart would disable the turrets for 20 to, uh, 10 to 20 seconds. Despite attempts to fix the program, the engineers could not solve the problem. In their opinion, it was caused by experiments on the lower levels of the hangar, which resulted in strong electromagnetic waves. This is a suggestion of some security employee to install more advanced system security uh, kit in place of the control turrets program. This would fix the problem of restarts and significantly improve the effectiveness of the hangar security systems. The response memo indicates the approval of it. You are not sure, but looks like the systems like this is used in your vault. Next note. As listed in the receipt, the employee of sec uh, security service has received complete and working SOS kit. What? The kit was brought from Hawthorne after field tests then further upgraded by local engineers, based on the feedback. The security service ordered to connect the kit to the security systems and check if it works as intended. What? Next note. As the uh, report indicates, the installation of Hawthorne's SOS kit did not produce expected results. The kit, for an unknown reason, didn't work. The manufacturer sent a statement about the need to retest the kit, but no response was given. Apparently, the military had no time to deal with the matter due to the outbreak of the Great War. In the end, the hangar was left without any external protection. The turrets were temporarily disabled. Okay. Uh, at least we're not getting aliens in here right now. Uh, reports on errors on the force fields. Orders on scheduled testing of force fields. An order on carrying an order on carrying out systematic routine inspection of the force fields. The inspector must inform the head of the security and management of the laboratories about each case of malfunction. The Department of Security proposes putting in use personal keycards to separately control the force fields. As it stands now, any staff member with intermediate access can enable or disable uh, can I, them all, which obviously does not meet security standards. Command ordered that the force fields must be reprogrammed and that sets of magnetic keycards with high levels of encryption must be produced. The order was sent to the maintenance sector, which resulted in adjustments to the force fields mode of operation. The maintenance sector's workers informed that the force field will be temporarily disabled due to reprogramming. Downtime is up to three days. Maintenance sector reports positive results of force fields reprogramming. A list of all personnel provided with magnetic key cards has been prepared. In addition, a new mode of operation has been enabled for the force fields. The maintenance sector reports the activation of enhanced operation mode for the force field. Specifically, it says that due to the high utilization rate of the equipment generating uh, the force fields, peri periodic two-hour shutdowns are implemented. In the absence of a control check procedure, which must be performed every 60 days and recorded in the computer on the first uh, underground level, the force fields will automatically shut down for fire safety purposes pending force activation. Uh, forced activation until the next control check. Blah, blah, blah. Jeez. Um, look for any mention of Vault 8. Information is scattered, but some documents are marked with a Project Vault 8 label. Read the order. Read the order 1123. The order was to set up a transmit uh, transit point of surveillance to monitor Vault 8. The station itself did not store any data, only relayed them to the top of the chain, the Hawthorne military base. After that, the process data was transmitted in the form of reports to Area 51. Summarized data. Although the vault... Ooh, a thousand experience point. The vault network was not part of the Area 51 area of responsibility. Vault 8 was an exception. The reason for this was that the vault has a status... Frickin' hell, between the frickin', you know, animations of them hit, getting hit and dying in the lower levels and taking control away from me, and me seeing these aliens walk about while I'm reading this, and the frickin' thing just changing pages, um, it's getting on my nerves. In an emer it had a status of governmental facility. In an emergency, Area 51 was supposed to contribute to the protection of the vault, but not to interfere in internal affairs. There was even an, in an initiative to install a force field barrier around the area, but there was not enough time and funding, as too many resources had already been allocated for the project. The function of guarding the vault was by default assigned to the Hawthorne military base, but in case of its inability to perform such functions, the task was to be delegated to Area 51. Okay, another one is the broken English. It was okay here, but... You know. Back, check out the hangar zone layouts. 
It turns out that the hangar extends many floors down. Some floors cannot be viewed because of the lack of access rights. Almost every floor is a laboratory or technical workshop. Apparently, the local military had a very busy schedule. Watch the first underground floor. The first underground floor is also a large laboratory. In addition, here is located the control center of the external line of defense. Obviously, it means the turrets and surveillance cameras, as well as the emergency generator. Where is that alien going? Is it going to open the doors? As well as the emergency generator and the control systems of the force fields and external ventilation. It is impossible to get below the first underground level due to strict security regulations. Aw. Well, that's it. Well, we got a thousand experience points, so that's good. 7-4. Uh, right, we've got this, and we've got the safe. Well, let's, uh, which one it is going to be? Uh, zero four. Uh, five, and then eight, nine, or six, eight, nine, or six, and five, oh, nine, or five, oh, nine, or nice code is correct. Let me mark it. Whoa, 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 where are you going? There we go. There's another cylinder. Okay. Let's go. To the lower level then, if we can. Okay. So these guys have all respawned for some reason. Maybe not. We can get rid of the cylinders. I don't think they can. you can actually sell them. Where are you going? Only one when there are three gas cylinders attached. Oh, okay. Oh, it can be run only when there are three. Okay. But we're obviously not going to do that right now. The installation is fully functional. All that's left is to enter the code and push the button. I guess that's the last code we have. The apparatus is completely filled. All that's left is to enter the code. Yeah. All right, never mind that. I'm not going to be doing that just yet. Um, well, actually, we can try, but obviously it's going to kill us as well. Mutated jelly-like floats. Ugh. Let's try to go down there and uh, kill the rest of those aliens. Thank you for taking control away from me. I really enjoy that. Oh shoot, they're here now. Okay. Come on then. Where are you going? Oh, I think there's one over there. No, there isn't. This is a creepy area. Oh, and it's, it's, uh, <laughs> gotten rid of this one. Access granted. Yeah, I'll take that for now. Very heavy. But... Yeah, where is this alien now? Down there. Hello. Would you like to come over here? Get fried? Sure you would. It's fun. Well, probably not. Uh, you know, that one force field is not really gonna kill him, though. Oh, nice. It actually... <gasps> Can they not get through? Does it always push them back like that? That's brilliant. Come on. Let's see. Nice. And we get the XP because we hit him. That could be a good way of uh, getting XP. Just stay here. Use the force field to hit him once. <laughs> Unlimited XP. It would take a long time, of course, but... Well, 
Could game the game, I suppose. Oh, they're back down here. There must be another one, right? I think. Right. Where is the other one? Seems like there's only one left. Excellent. Hello. Yeah, of course it's gonna miss. No. Yeah. Huh? 58, very nice. Yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. Well, but we can go right back. Still got 96 hit points. Holy moly. No, I wanted... Uh, I wanted the aim shot. Oh. 90% 89 now 52, that's more like it That's more like it 82, I don't understand why It goes down I've never understood that Why does the hit chance go down? 89 now Very nice 525 for this one So what can we do with this? Can we do anything? Can we repair it? You cannot get there. No, cannot repair that. So, that's kind of pointless. I guess this entire area apart... Oh, there is another alien there. I guess apart from that box... Has crippled limbs. Man, they're fast. They are very. No! I wanted to. Damn. Keep forgetting to change the mode. Aha! 50. Very nice. Okay, they can only attack twice if I move with three action points afterwards. That's not too bad. 31. Oh, <laughs> nice. 47. All right. Well, anyway, thank you very much for watching. A big thank you to my patrons. And I will see you all next time. Bye-bye.